Well, the weather is uh, improving just a little bit. Uh, first alert live radar showing some breaks in the action. Let's uh, take a look at it. And what we've been noticing is that the first batch of rain kind of slid on out, a little lull. But we have a secondary batch of rain that is uh, moving in, especially that's going to be clipping our southernmost counties. So we want to give you a first alert. Uh, it could be a little bit on the heavier side. You can see those brighter colors uh, shaping up uh, to the south of Danbury. Again, this is all moving eastward. It is starting to move in close to Milford, New Haven, West Haven, Hamden. You're all going to see some of this heavier rainfall. The future radar shows you the time. So here's the time slot in which that heavier rain is going to reach perhaps your location. Uh, Haddam, Chester, Durham, that will be, you know, an hour from now. Uh, that rain will get to you, but certainly a lot sooner if you're back uh, towards the west, uh, towards New Haven. Future casts indicating that rain continuing off and on tonight. There's through 8 o'clock we get into tomorrow morning though as promised the rain moves on out we get some breaks of sunshine developing the breeze is going to be increasing from the north and it is going to be a decent day a little chilly out there and there could be a random little sprinkle or shower that develops but all in all we are dry for Sunday and then we're going to have this system kind of spinning around some colder air aloft and that usually means you get a little bit more sunshine to start in the day but during the afternoon you can get those little pop up showers to develop so just a low end chance for a stray shower on Monday. Very similar forecast on Tuesday. So it is chillier out there right now than we were 24 hours ago, about 5 to 10 degrees cooler, upper 40s and low 50s dominating across the state. So definitely in a jacket as you head out. That raincoat may be needed. Certainly New Haven, that rain's coming your way again. And it is 52 degrees. Winds are light at your location. The forecast for New Haven is going to be very similar across the state, uh, but you can get your local forecast of through the first alert weather app have it set to follow you low 50s the next several hours and often on showers even past midnight but it should wrap up by the time we get towards sunrise tomorrow so a cool night ahead back down into the 40s where we typically should be for this time of year uh, now we have much better weather for the riverton fair they're going to be enjoying again more sunshine, a few clouds from time to time, and those temperatures will be a little cool but breezy. But as long as it's not raining, it's like who cares? Let's get out there and enjoy the beautiful weather. And we're going to see those readings below average by a few degrees, upper 50s to 60s. And if you have plans to take a ride north tomorrow, got to get up into the higher terrain, the mountainous terrain right now in northern New England. That's where you're going to see the peak of the color, the fall foliage. Your first alert seven day forecast showing you those cloudy skies from time to time, not full sunshine pretty much until we get to Wednesday and Thursday. And then ugh, Friday, Saturday, here we go again. We're probably gonna make it number 16 out of 21 weekends with rain. We made it 15 out of 20 this weekend. And then those shoreline temperatures are going to be on the cool side initially, but everyone gets to warm up by the middle to late portion of next week. That's your first alert forecast.